These are the time trials for Mario Kart Tour Halloween Tour. I had heard some people were struggling with some of these time trials, being able to get the, the time under the expected time for three grand stars. So I'm going to run through these with you, and we'll see how if what it, how I did it in order to get the times needed to be successful. Now keep in mind, the priority of these time trials is not to get the most items or to get the most coins. The, the most important part is to finish the race as fast as possible. Okay? Now, I started this race with the time trials. A lot of times on uh, the console games, the best time to use an item is very early on in order to get up to top speed very right away. Um, and so that's what I did with this one. I used one of my two mushrooms, because you only get the two mushrooms with each time trial. I used one of my two mushrooms right away immediately. However, there was a shortcut later on that would benefit me, that would be more of a benefit to me than getting uh, up to speed the fastest that I could. So, um, I'm saving my second mushroom for that. Okay, for that run. Spending a lot of time in the air. Try, Got to cut in these curves. And here's the ramp. Hit the ramp. Back on track. So that shortcut would have cut, cut down um, maybe a half a second or so to my time in order to give me success. So, very first run. This was actually from my very first run, my very first time through. I got through um, with 116.68 out of one. 20 was what was needed to get three grand stars. So that was early run, really early run, got through that. Okay, so moving from the Luigi Cup, we are going to be moving over to the bonus challenge on the Toadette Cup. And this will have us with Bowser Jr. Okay, I'm hanging on to my two mushrooms this time. Although, now that I think about it, that may have been pointless because, um, yeah, because I there aren't really any shortcuts in this one. Okay. So, as you can see, I'm catching drifts any time that I can. You can see me shifting back and forth and shifting back and forth in order to get those extra drifts. Cutting corners closer will shave a tiny bit of time off if you can pull it off getting really in close on those curves hugging the curves can be a bit of a help obviously you want to stay away from the water puddles and you want to stay on the inside the coins are not as important so got through here we go second lap i've used both of my mushrooms <coughs> at this point Catching these small drifts where I can and getting the turbos. It is not a good idea to ride the corners, to ride the outside of the corners where you see my cart kind of pushing up against the corner. That will actually slow you down. So when I'm in those tubes and I'm rubbing up against those corners, I'm actually hurting those outside corners. I'm actually hurting my time by doing that. So, but which is, it's kind of tricky to do it, to get it, with these um with those tubes so cleared 139.65 and i believe it was 140 for all three stars so this was actually a second run i went from obviously from um two stars to three stars if you check my first run you'll see i only got two stars on it okay so moving on from toadette cup to the final time trial is on the mario cup so this is going to be Donkey Kong. Did, excuse me, Diddy Kong. And off we go. Catch those curves wherever possible. Get those jumps, those bouncing off of things. And 
and there's two different routes you can take. The inside, oh, excuse me, three different routes you can take. The inside track and the outside track. Inside, middle, and outside. The inside and middle, I think, are the same speed. But here's where I'm going to use that mushroom. I used it at the get-go, at the starting, and then I used it again there. Going to bounce off the dinosaur. Or, nope, I missed the dinosaur. That, um, that shortcut really cuts quite a bit of time off. So when possible, save your mushrooms for that. Obviously, I used both of my mushrooms in the first round, so I'm not going to be able to take that in the second round. But if you can take that in both rounds, if you can get it right and take that in both rounds, that should shave a lot of time off. Okay. So I'm going to take the middle road this time instead of the inside road. And I think the inside and the middle road are the same are the same distance, the same speed, the same all that kind of stuff. And obviously, I can't take the shortcut. But I can hit these. Oop. Hit the little ramps. Oop, missed that one. In order to um, get the extra, the extra bounce and the extra boost because of that. Hit the dinosaur that time. Around the last curve. And this should get me through. There we go. 149.66 beats the 150 needed to make this one a three star. Yep. Obviously, things could have gone better, but they went well enough. So this is JC Masterpiece, and these are the three time trials from the Halloween tour. Feel free to like, feel free to subscribe, and share. Thank you so much for watching, and have a great day, everybody.